Before you watch this video, I would just like to apologise. I don't know why I'm so shiny, but I'm really, really shiny and orange. My hair's wet because I just got out of the bath. Don't watch the video thinking, oh my God, she's shiny and she doesn't realise. I realise, I know, I just don't want to refilm the video. <laughs> Hello guys, I hope you're all well. Today I have got a pretty big shopping haul to share with you. Homeware, clothing, clothes for me me and the boys so lots to get on with and i am going to start with lush the smells are actually really overpowering i really really love lush but um <sighs> can give me a bit of a headache okay so the first one that i got is the twilight bath ballistic and it looks like this it's got little stars on and it just smells so sweet. I can't really explain what it smells like, but just really nice and sweet and kind of caramelly. And it's one that it goes pink and then there's blue in the middle of it and glitter and can't wait to use it. Um, the next one is called Dream Steam and it's a tablet. This is for Pete. Um, it's for his face. So it looks like this, it's just a tiny tablet. Doesn't really kind of just smells like a spa um, and it just kind of clears up any redness in your face and you just lean like put it in a bowl of hot water lean over the bowl with a towel over you as if you're inhaling like vapor rub or something um, and you don't need to breathe it in or anything but it's just for your skin next up I got the yuzu and cocoa bubble cream which is like a macaroon like so and this one smells yuzu and cocoa is yuzu a flavour? I don't know. It doesn't smell lemony, but it's just nice and fresh and sweet because, as you can tell, I really like sweet things. Um, and this is a good one because it's got that cream layer of cocoa in the middle and you can kind of break it up so it's not just a one use. You can actually use it like two, maybe three times. There we go, mint juleps, lip scrub. And it's mint chocolate and it's just like a little scrub that you scrub on your lips and then wipe away and it leaves them nice and soft. I went a little bit crazy. And then this one, I love the look of. This is called Sunnyside and it's a bubble bar slice. And I just think it looks like a bindi. Like so. Um, was it that way? But yeah, this one, I only got, it smells like sherbet, I got because the guy in the shop said that it went really well with this one, which is called Karma. Um, so purple with the gold on top. And when they're mixed in the bath together, they just give this really like luxurious kind of, look and that that one just smells like soap like standard soap i don't really think it has that nice of a smell but mixed in with the gold it just looked lovely and then the last one this is what i got for the boys jasper never has anything in the bath because he's got such sensitive skin but this is called the ickle baby bot and it's a bath ballistic um and it's in the shape of a robot and apparently it's fine for sensitive skin it's made of like lavender and um just soothing ingredients to help them sleep at night. So that's always a plus. Okay, the next shop I went into was Primark. I actually went in to get loads of homeware stuff because I follow them on Instagram and I just saw so many really nice things like little fake succulent plants and there was loads I wanted, but apparently that's mainly from the Reading store. So I ended up not getting that much homeware stuff, but I did get some. I got this lime light soda candle and it's lovely, it smells like lime soda. I've had it burning in the kitchen. That was three pounds. And then the next one is this tea light holder. So you can see it's got like the copper holder on the inside and then the copper rim here. That was also three pounds. The little copper ball tea lights. I haven't got any batteries in so I can't show you them on but I just thought they were really, really nice and I might swap them for these lights, put these up in the bedroom. Um, yeah, just thought they were quite lovely and they were, I want to say like six pounds. They were relatively cheap. I got a couple of necklaces. So this is the first one. So just kind of two solid bars and then the loose chain. And that was two pounds. This one was a pound and it's just got the V-shaped bar like so. And then I got these two big ones, which were two for a pound. I then got some clothes. So I got this ribbed sleeveless kind of high neck top. So it's black and then it's just a nice stretchy material. That was four pounds and that's in a size 10. Normally I'd get an eight or a six, but um, this comes up quite tight. So bear that in mind. 
I also got this one. Again, oh no, this is a size 8. Just a nice plain white top, cotton t-shirt, and it's got the grey rim around the arm and the neckline. Um, just a nice one to wear with jeans. I also bought this one, but I think I'm going to take it back because it's really see-through. Like, I don't know if you can see me through it, but um, even if you wore the same colour bra, it would just be ridiculously see-through. But it's a nice kind of burgundy colour. Again, high neck, ribbed. So I really liked it, but um, yeah, I mean, you can see the light through it. That's crazy. And then I bought some ripped skinny jeans, like so. I've been wearing them, so the rips have kind of worn in a little bit. And these are a size six, but they're really, really big. They're really, really like, I don't know if they're meant to be, they're not meant to be low rise. I don't know, but they come up really big. So also bear that in mind. Um, but yeah, just skinny, pale denim, and they were 12 pounds. The next shop I went into was TK Mac. So I got this necklace, which is from a brand called Mythology. This was £20 and I got it to wear to a wedding last Sunday. I also picked up this little clutch bag. It's got like a, a strap that you can add to it. But it's £17, kind of like a dog tooth print. And then for Jasper, well, for Reese and Jasper, probably more Reese, and then when he grows out of it, Jasper, we got this little yellow rain mat. It's so cute. I've been looking for one for Jasper for ages. This is the only one that we could find that we really liked, but it's an age four. It's a Ralph Lauren one. So it's got the little logo just on the side there. And then on the back, it's got, what's that for? Is that so you can turn it inside out or into a bag? I don't know. I don't really know. Make it a bit more breathable maybe. Um, and then it's got the little peak on the hood, but yeah, like I said, it's aged four, so even Reese isn't going to be in it for a couple of years, and that was £29.99, so quite expensive, but we're going to have it for a few years, I'm sure. Okay, the next thing is a little Ralph Lauren shirt. I've mentioned before a few times in different TK Maxx hauls that we like to get Ralph Lauren shirts because, see, they're a lot cheaper in TK Maxx, they're really good quality, and... Yeah, I wouldn't want to pay full price for them, but if you can get them at a good price, then it's good. Um, this one was £17. It's age two, but I think it'd be too big for Reese at the moment. And it's just a really nice kind of denim -y feel, dusky pink. And it's nice as well because the logo isn't just in a plain colour, it's kind of actually different colours. So that one. And then it got two Polo Ralph Lauren t-shirts. This one is age three. <laughs> they didn't really have much in their size, anything in their size really. Um, it's just navy colour with the orange logo and that was £15. And then this one is age two, so this might fit Reese now. Um, and it's just purple with the yellow logo. And again, that was £15. The next shop I went into was Mothercare. I had a £20 voucher to spend for Reese and another 20 for Jasper. I think they got it for their birthday a little while ago. So the first thing I got was this cushion. This was down to like, £5 in the sale. And it's just a nice like grey pattern with a yellow elephant. And it says life's for living. Because their new bedroom, I haven't started doing it yet. But I think I'm going to make it jungle theme. Not like loads of bright colours. But like greys and whites. And then a few portraits of animals and things like that. And then on the other side it's like a creamy colour with yellow triangles. It's very nice and geometric. And then I've also been looking for a little yellow wellies for Jasper. I wanted him to have like Paddington Bear, like little yellow, no, Paddington Bear's red and blue, isn't he? But that kind of thing, a little rain mac and wellies. And I found these ones and I just think they're so cute. They are size five um, and he's a three, I want to say. Um, so he's got a little bit of time before he'll fit in those, but maybe by Christmas time. I just thought they were really, really cute. And they were £10 in the sale. And then Reese is obsessed with dinosaurs, so I got him a little two-pack of dinosaur pyjamas. So these little ones, just long sleeved. they've got the little kind of collared bits on the ankles and the hands and wrists. And they came with this one that says dinosaur with little stripy blue bottoms. Because it's started to get really chilly now, so I think we need to have the winter pyjamas. And they were £14 for the set of two. And then for Jasper, I got robots. He's not really into anything in particular, so I just 
kind of saw what was there. These were £10 for both sets, so a little robot on there and the stripy trousers and then a little navy blue with light blue and the matching trousers. So Jasper's are in I think 18 months and Reese's are in two to three so they'll have a little bit of use out of those. And then for Reese and Jasper, little egg and spoon set you get, I don't know where the other one is but you get four different spoons and then you get little eggs like this and they've got the bean bag eggs inside so I thought that was really cute and that was a tenner for that game okay next up I went into Asda I really wanted a new bath mat because our bathroom is very white like white walls white ceiling white floors white like toilet and bath and everything and at the time I had a grey bath mat and white towels and stuff and it was just too light it needed some colour so I went and got this one from Asda so it's yellow and white and grey so it still brings in the lightness it's still nice and fresh and just like a nice bobbly one and I think that was six pounds um so yeah I just thought I'd bring in a bit of colour and this one caught my eye first and lastly I went to Dorothy Perkins and I picked up a dress which I wore to the wedding on Sunday so it just looks like this, it's a shift dress, so really nice and floaty, um, kind of just a straight across collar, and then the zip detailing at the back. So really, really simple, something you could just wear with sandals during the day or dress it up in the evening. I just wore it with sandals, like jazzy sandals, that kind of blingy necklace, and that clutch bag. So it's still quite nice and simple. So that is everything. I want to know where anything is from, if I've forgotten to mention, or how much they were or what sizes or anything then just leave a comment below and yeah I will see you next time please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and all of that jazz bye